We're here with Dan and Gus, new managers for next season at Tigers. Dan, you're new at the club. What sort of attracted you to become manager at Tigers? I've uh, got a good relationship with yourself, obviously, and, um, and Gus. And when Gus asked me to come down and give him a hand, uh, I was more than happy to do so. Um, but now, now I'm here and I see how hard working the lads are as well. It's really um, spurred me on to you know, stay here. And Gus, obviously, you've been at Tigers now for two seasons. Is managing something that you always wanted to do at the start? Well, I think after joining for the first season, I was a bit complacent about how it would go. But after playing for two years now, you realise it's just it's a nice club to be at. And I thought, you know, I want to stay and kind of give that actually died at the start and pass it on to the new players, you know. And Dan, obviously, what was the update from tonight? You were at both sessions. Were you impressed with what you saw today? Yeah, more than impressed. A uh, good number of lads coming down, which is what we'd like to see. Hopefully, have everyone involved next season. Um, quality is high, as you'd expect from any Tigers team. Uh, and uh, hopefully we can put two, two sides out in two different divisions and compete equally in both. And Gus, as Dan said, there was a lot of quality on show tonight. Uh, what, what are your real, realistic targets for next season? You know, obviously it's, it's good to do as well as you can in the league. I think aiming for top spaces would be a, an initial goal. Also, you know, we love a top, uh, cup run here at Tigers, so that would be good. So I'm just looking forward to, you know, getting in the boardroom with Dan, really. Get some tactics. <laughs> Carry on. Get some, uh, get some new tactics that you want to play. There's a couple of formations you want to try out. You know, just push forward the kind of ways we want to play for the club. Yeah, and Dan, I had a question. I've forgotten what it was. Um, <laughs> so you, so you looking forward oh, to working? It was actually quite a good one. As well. So you looking forward to working alongside Cast? I uh, know the next one. Okay. And Dan, uh, what's the plan for the next trial session and joining now? Um, we want all the lads to stay involved, um, keeping keeping Twitter active. We, um, you know, we like seeing that and uh, lads being interested. Um, now, going forward, what we need to do is we need to make a selection, see who's going to be playing A's and B's next season, and uh, create a bit of a competition between the two sides. And Gus, have you got a message for any players that maybe trialed for the A team that maybe might play for the B team next season? You know, I wouldn't say be disheartened if you don't get picked for the A team. There's always when you when you get put into a B team, you get that, given that motivation, you want to drive up into the A team. So I wouldn't say that um, to be uh, demotivated or unhappy the decision because it's just if if anything should spur you on to play more football. All right, cheers, boys. See you next Excuse season. Me. See you next season. Yeah, yeah. <laughs>